What is the dumbest thing you've made someone believe? When I was in high school, I had quite a few friends who ended up moving to different parts of the USA. We live in Canada. One of my friends was in the Palm Springs area for all of junior year and came back that summer to visit. Now, Americans truly are not the brightest for knowing things that happen outside of their borders. Whist bringing up the differences in their educational systems, my friend had told me that the more and more people would ask stupid questions about Canada, the more ideas she got. So, with the brilliant mind of mixing Canadian stereotypes and the gullibility of American teenagers, she told all of her friends that Canada was home to many wild penguins in the winters. The penguins were also very overpopulated. So driving in Canada during winter, it's inevitable that you'll come across penguin roadkill. Now after hearing about this ruse to fool the gullible, I wanted to test it out myself. I have family friends that live in the San Francisco area and they come back to Canada about twice a year. So once they arrived back to the land of wild penguins, I told them the story. They have family in Canada and visit all the time, so obviously they know how ridiculous this lie was. But they truly had zero faith in any of their friends back home. They started texting their friends asking if they'd ever heard about it. At first they were a little bit skeptical, but after the Canadian girl, me, talked to them, they had no chance. Majority of them thought it was crazy. The surprising part was only one person asked for evidence. So what did we do? Well, we Google searched penguins in public areas and sent it over. And that was the kicker. Obviously, as a teenager, I decided to further test my theory of American stupidity, so I went on Omegle. Once I found a couple of kids my age, and if they were from America, I started my interrogation. Sadly, a lot of them still think we live in igloos, or that it's an actual thing we all must do in the winter. Then I'd start with this question. You guys don't have the overpopulation of penguins down there, right? Immediate confusion. Usually ask what in the world you're even talking about. And my fellow Canadians, if you ever want to do this, here's what I always say. Well, in the winter it gets unbearably cold in the territories, so a lot of their wild penguins migrate down into the bigger, more urban areas. Like Calgary, Edmonton, Vancouver, Regina, etc. Since it's so urban though, there tends to be an overpopulation around the cities. You can find a lot of penguin roadkill around those winter months. As well as if you drive out to the farms and ranches in the countryside, you can find some penguins in the fields just doing their thing. As the winter approaches its end, the penguins migrate back to the territories to maintain their cold environment. You'd be surprised how believable it can be. To be fair, they don't know any better. I mean, their school system is very American history dominate. But to any American that may be reading this, we are not kidding. There are wild penguins, or not. You'll never know.